Welcome back to Shenzhen Zen Jamaican Vibes. So, um, I have finally gotten the chance to dig deep into the barrel that was donated from Georgia, which I say was from an anonymous donor. And so now I'm going to show you guys what I got from Georgia. And of course, I will post the videos of when I'm donating the content of this barrel. So here we go. So this is what came in the barrel that was donated from Georgia from my anonymous donor. Um, we have a lot of tunas, we have baked beans, corned beef, condensed milk, we have some salmon, we have sardines in a row. There's some more sardines over there. We had gotten some books. Coffee. I'm gonna go around that side. Um, we have um, toothbrush and toothpastes. The books were actually for my back to school treat and the toothbrush and toothpastes, but they came a little late. And so, um, some of these items I will save for next year August for my back to school treat, or if I need arrive and um, someone needs, I will, you know, give it to them. But, um, guys. I want you guys to remember also that you should start donating early for the back to school treat next year because we want to get at least a thousand backpacks. As you can see from my previous video of the treat, the need is very much great. And um, as I said, next year we're doing it different. We'll be getting some security so things can be done. One bag, donate three. If you plan to donate three books, donate six. Because uh, the need is definitely great. Alright, so these are some keys. We have some white rice, brown rice. Um, quite a few packs of noodles. As you can see, right? And um, a few of these items I already donated when I was donating some items from the barrel from the UK. I kind of just mix, mix and match and so that they know most of the barrels are, you know, when we need a right, I'll keep back a little so I can have for people who really need it, you know? Because there's some people with want and there's some people with need. As, um, as someone said, it's not for the greedy, but for the needy. So um, these are the content of this barrel and I want to say thank you again to my anonymous donor from the UK. Um, I'm going to go on the other side. Alright, so there we go. Now you can see better. We have um, some coffee here. Different flavor. Coffee. And condensed milk you can see better from this side it's quite a few cans and these are the items that i sell for the back to school treat some pens and pencils quite a few packs of pencils toothbrush toothpaste these are the books that we had gotten um they came in late and we have um some noodles here Lots of noodles. We have pasta. Quite a few packs of pasta. We have cooking oil over here. Cooking oil and the ketchups and oatmeal. So thank you again to my donor, my anonymous donor from Georgia who donated this barrel to my program. I also want to say um, as it relates to the single father and his children, um, you guys we need to keep Jordan in school. So I'm asking for those who can donate to please reach out to me and donate. I haven't gotten any donation for them in a while and um, it's very important for me to help Jordan to stay in school. Uh, I will be going by 
soon to give them some of the groceries from this particular barrel and um, and to check on Peter Gay as well as you can see I'm sweating from um, all of the from digging up the barrier uh, it's really hot in here um, one of the things that I want to do with this building because it is it's a nice size building um, as you all know it was my bar way before I started doing YouTube I have this place and it is during the pandemic um, Whenever we had to close, most of the stuff that I had in the bar, they kind of just expired. So I just kind of closed it down. And then when I started doing YouTube, I was just doing the farming videos. Then when I started to help people with housing and food, I started getting barrels. So I ended up using the bar for my storage. However, um, thinking about getting some metal shelves or some wooden shelf so I can better organize when I get barrels I can better organize can stuff separate from whatever else I get so when I have when I need arrive I know exactly where to go to find something because for now most of the things I kind of after I pack them out will bag them out if I'm not going to do a distribution right away I have to put them back in the barrel because sometimes another barrel come and I have to pack out so I need the space so I think if I had more shelves I know if I had more shelves it would be better organized so I'll be asking for some assistance with that soon so thank you so much to my anonymous donor from Georgia who donated this barrel to my program all right that's it guys and as I said when I do the distribution you will definitely see the video all right so thank you guys so much for watching and thanks for making it shines and zen jamaican vibes until next time walk good and look out for your neighbor <laughs>